Phil Collins, a prominent figure in the music industry, has left an enduring mark through his impactful contributions. Whether it's the rhythmic beats of his drumming or the soulful resonance of his voice, Collins' work spans across generations, resonating with audiences worldwide. Many first encountered his talent through iconic pieces like his solo hits or his time with the band Genesis, capturing hearts with his distinct sound and poignant lyrics. Reflecting on experiences with his music often evokes cherished memories for fans, reminding them of moments that have become intertwined with Collins' timeless compositions. What about you? What's your most cherished memory or personal experience connected to this legendary musician? Share your stories and reminisce below. We'd love to hear them. In 1988, during the peak of success in both solo career and Genesis, Collins became one of the 100 richest individuals in Britain. By 2009, his net worth soared to 177 million as estimated by the Sunday Times list. However, in a surprising turn, he declared in the same year that due to a spinal injury, he could no longer drum. This unforeseen announcement marked a significant shift in his musical journey. Now, let's delve into the song Easy Lover, a collaborative masterpiece. Crafted by Collins, Nathan East, and Philip Bailey, this track was a joint effort that showcased Collins and Bailey on vocals. The video, filmed in London, captured Bailey arriving at the studio in a helicopter, leading into spirited performances in various locales like a studio and a local restaurant. Collins included this hit in his live shows and incorporated it into his albums, further solidifying its place in his musical repertoire. This unexpected twist in his health coupled with the enduring success of Easy Lover paints a dynamic picture of Phil Collins's journey in music, highlighting both his triumphs and challenges. Amidst his journey in music, Collins transitioned seamlessly from backing vocals to lead singer in Genesis after Peter Gabriel's departure. Fans embraced his shift due to his familiarity with the band's repertoire. This pivotal move marked the beginning of his prominence in Genesis. His influence wasn't confined to Genesis alone. Collins dominated the U.S. charts with numerous singles, solidifying his solo career. Hits like Against All Odds, Susudio, and Another Day in Paradise cemented his place in the music industry. Notably, his diverse talents extended beyond singing, as seen in his cameo in George Harrison's When We Was Fab. Collins's ability to navigate multiple musical roles underscores his lasting impact on the industry. Renowned for his enduring impact on the music scene, this artist's legacy spans decades of chart-topping hits and memorable performances. His music resonates deeply, weaving its way through the fabric of popular culture. Notably, one of his seminal tracks, In the Air Tonight, originally earmarked for a Genesis collective, unexpectedly became the cornerstone of his solo triumphs, igniting a trajectory that solidified his individual artistic prowess. Beyond his musical feats, his visual storytelling through music videos garnered acclaim, culminating in an Academy Award for the heartfelt You'll Be In My Heart. His journey navigates through a tapestry of genres, each note and lyric echoing his distinctive style and resonating with audiences worldwide. The melodic evolution of his craft stands as a testament to his unwavering dedication to the art form, forever etching his name in the annals of music history. This legacy, a fusion of talent and innovation, continues to inspire generations, leaving an everlasting imprint on the sonic landscape. This musical narrative, a tale of resilience and creative brilliance, remains an unparalleled testament to the power of artistic expression. Phil Collins, a musician known for his diverse collaborations, ventured beyond Genesis, leaving an imprint on various artists' works. He drummed for Robert Plant's initial solo albums and joined Eric Clapton on his journeyman track, showcasing his versatility. Notably, his 1989 single Another Day in Paradise shed light on homelessness, sparking debate due to his millionaire status. Despite criticism, he raised funds at concerts, matching the collected amount to aid homeless causes. His involvement with social issues wasn't new. Genesis Man on the Corner addressed homelessness in 1981. Additionally, Collins's personal life reflects his expansive creativity, fathering children who've pursued diverse careers from music to acting, enriching his legacy in more ways than one. Amidst his musical career, Collins extends his support to the Topsy Foundation in South Africa, donating all royalties earned there. His dedication to philanthropy aligns with his musical success. 
1994, he received recognition for his charitable and musical contributions, becoming a lieutenant of the Royal Victorian Order. Beyond music, Collins harbors a deep fascination with the Alamo, evidenced by his collection of Alamo memorabilia and authorship of the Alamo and Beyond, A Collector's Journey. These varied interests showcase his multifaceted personality beyond his musical prowess, marking a notable facet of his life and passions. Phil Collins's fascination with history extends beyond music. An avid enthusiast of the Alamo in San Antonio, Texas, Collins frequently visits the historic site and has amassed a collection of artifacts from its grounds. Notably, he lends his voice to a Battle of the Alamo exhibit located just outside the site, providing narration that adds a personal touch to this historical display. While Collins's musical journey is well documented, his interest in the Alamo offers a unique glimpse into the artist's multifaceted personality. This connection to history adds another layer to the man behind the music, showcasing a passion that goes beyond the rhythm and beats he's known for. The Alamo, with its rich historical significance, becomes a backdrop that unveils a different side of Phil Collins, bridging the gap between his musical accomplishments and his personal pursuits. Beyond the stage and recording studio, Collins' involvement with the Alamo and its artifacts paints a vivid picture of a musician with a deep appreciation for history. This unexpected aspect of his life adds to the enigma of Phil Collins, making him not only a chart-topping artist, but also a curator of historical narratives. This exploration into the Alamo, a departure from the expected, exemplifies how Collins's interests transcend the boundaries of his musical realm. Intriguingly, this historical connection stands as a testament to the layers within Phil Collins's life, proving that his impact extends beyond music into the realms of history and storytelling. The Alamo becomes more than a place, it becomes a symbol of Collins's diverse interests, enriching his legacy in ways that resonate far beyond the notes of his iconic songs. In a remarkable feat on July 13, 1985, Phil Collins showcased his versatility by playing at both Live Aid concerts in London and Philadelphia on the same day. Boarding a British Airways Concorde, he flew from London to New York and then took a helicopter to Philadelphia. There, Collins drummed for Eric Clapton, performed a solo set, and filled in for John Bonham during Led Zeppelin's performance. This unprecedented accomplishment demonstrated Collins's commitment to charitable causes and solidified his place in music history. Fast forward to 1999, where Collins reunited with his former Genesis bandmates for a re-recording of The Carpet Crawlers, a track from their 1974 album. This collaboration marked a significant reunion, with Peter Gabriel joining the band for the first time since 1982. Steve Hackett, though present, participated only in the encore. This event brought together the iconic members, showcasing the enduring bond and influence of Genesis in the world of music. Beyond his musical endeavors, Collins became a trustee of the Prince's Trust in 1983 and attended the wedding of King Charles III and Queen Camilla as an esteemed guest. These involvements highlight Collins's commitment to philanthropy and recognition within prestigious circles. From Live Aid triumphs to Genesis reunions and royal connections, Phil Collins's impact extends beyond his musical prowess, painting a diverse picture of an artist whose influence reaches far beyond the notes of his iconic songs. This is Phil Collins, a man of musical milestones and charitable endeavors, leaving an everlasting imprint on the global stage.